In this video, we will learn to fix Dynasty Warriors 9 error VCOMP140.dll. So let's begin. So to fix the VCOM140.dll error, just go in the description and there will be a link to this page that is dll-files.com. Once you click on this and that link, you will be landed on this page where the heading says download VCOM140.dll. Once you are here, just scroll down below. In here what you have to do is just go and download the 32-bit and the 64-bit file uh, DLL file and you have to keep care that both the files have the same version so here is a 32-bit file with the for, uh, with the version and here is the same file uh, file version of the 64-bit so the version must be same you have to take care of that so just go and first download the 32-bit DLL file and here the download will start in few moments so just go and wait for it, it so the download has started and completed now we would download the 64-bit version uh, and the version must be same so just go and download this one so just go and wait for it to complete meanwhile what you have to do is just go and check your computer what kind of computer you have whether it is 64-bit or 32-bit so just go and right click this PC click on properties in this video we will solve the system for 32-bit as well as 64-bit so don't worry for anything and here against the system type you can see that what kind of system we have so we have 64-bit system don't worry we will solve it for 32-bit system as well so the download of both 32-bit and 64-bit is complete now what you have to do is just go to your download folder here it is just go and extract the 32-bit DLL file first now go and extract the 64-bit DLL file so here is a 32-bit uh, sorry here is a 32-bit file and here is a 64-bit file so first we would solve the problem for 32-bit operating systems so what you have to do is just go and open the 32-bit DLL file here is the DLL file just go and right click it copy it and go to your this PC go to local disk C go to Windows and here just scroll down below and search for system32 here we have system32 just go and open that and paste the 32-bit DLL file here paste it here continue so go back we have solved the problem for 32-bit operating system now we would start solving the problem for 64-bit operating system for 64-bit operating system just go and open the 64-bit DLL file folder and just copy the 64-bit DLL file go to your Windows folder and here go to system32 folder open that and paste the 64-bit DLL file here and click continue once you have done so go back to Windows folder and here again what you have to do is just go and copy the 32-bit DLL file copy it and now go to your windows folder and here just scroll down below and search for sys wow64 here we have sys wow64 just go and open that and paste the 32-bit DLL file here paste it here so here it is now we had so we have solved the problem for 64-bit or bit operating system also if you still have any confusion from where to copy where to paste I would paste all the uh, details in the description so you can just go and see that Hope by doing so your problem will be solved. If you still have any confusion or error just comment down below. I will try to answer that. But before you go please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.